how to set up the new iPad Air 2025 or the iPad Pro and transfer data from an older iPad over to the new uh, iPad. So first, let's um, turn on your iPad. So you can press and hold the power button to uh, switch it on. Once it is turned on, on this screen, go to your older iPad. Sometimes on the older iPad, it will pop up uh, with some information on the, on the screen where you can uh, set up new iPad. So here's it, set up new iPad. So tap on unlock to continue. And I'll use the passcode. So I'll put in the passcode to verify it. Okay, so now we'll try connect to the iPad. So on the old iPad, you want to use the camera and scan this dot right here. So I will try to scan the dot. Okay, so once you have scanned the, that green circle, it's a finish on new iPad. So we now go to the new iPad. And here it's us enter passcode of your other iPad. So on the older iPad, we're going to enter the passcode. Okay, so we put in the passcode. So sign in manually, or we try again. Okay, here it's just enter in the passcode. Okay, next in here, we tap on continued. And here's a setup face ID. So we can choose to set up face ID now, or you can choose to set up later. So if you want to set up face ID now, tap on the continue button. And then we're going to use the camera to scan for face ID. So here we rotate to portrait mode and tap on the get started button and so position your face within the frame so you need to move your head around and complete the green circle right here and so first face id scan complete so tap on the continue button and now we need to scan again so complete this green circle and then now the face id is now set up and tap on continued here transfer the data over tap on continued and so setting up your Apple ID. Okay, here tap on agree. And now it is signing in. Okay, so now it is signing in still. We wait for the sign in to complete. Here, so make this your new iPad. So we're going to choose apps and data and tap on continue, or you can tap on the customize button. You say update your iPad automatically. So tap on continued or only download automatically. So I'll tap on continued. And here we choose turn on location services. Or you can choose set up later. Next, if you use Apple Pay, you can set up now by tapping on the continue button or uh, set up later. I'm going to choose set up later for Apple Pay. Next, you can set up Siri now. So tap on the continue if you want to set up Siri now or you can choose to set up later. So it says share audio recording. So tap on that and then tap on continued for screen time. Now for iPad analytics, tap on share with Apple or don't share. Next, we need to choose our display. So either light, dark or auto. And then tap on continued. Now you need to sign into your Apple ID account. I will choose uh, skip this step. Okay, now it is transferring the data over. So if we look at this old iPad, it's a transferring data to iPad. And here it is now transferring data uh, from the iPad. Okay, so we just want to wait for that to finish. Now, depending on how much uh, data that you have on the iPad, this may be quick or it may take a long time if you have uh, a lot of data to uh, transfer over here. It gives you a rough uh, time estimate of how long it will take. So it shows here, time remaining is about 12 minutes. So we wait for that to complete. Okay, so after it has finished, 
uh, make sure you have signed into your app store once you sign into your app store with your apple account uh, the apps will be uh, downloaded so now it's waiting for the apps to be downloaded this may take uh, some time and here if we go to our uh, ipad it's a transfer complete and just put in the password okay so that's complete right there now on the old iPhone, uh, old ipad it offers us to uh, erase the ipad if you want we can uh, erase the ipad now or you can choose not now and that's it so that's how you can set up your ipad and transfer the data over you can always go into settings and review um, what uh, has been done he's asking for two-factor authentications okay so i have cancelled that uh, we go to the top check we have sign in uh, you can check all the other settings wi-fi automatically imported from the old ipad so we don't need to set up wi-fi uh, settings uh, if you need to set up Wi-Fi password, you can do so. And that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you found it helpful. Please like and subscribe to my channel for my videos.